Okay. Where was I? So you want to you want to put the little notch. Once you got the notch in there, say like that. You want to take your knife, just you know a normal knife. This is where a multi tool comes in, because you can have all your different knives and tools and stuff. So you just want to cut out that notch so that it's actually a notch rather than just a cut. Basically just open it up. And make sure that notch is notchy enough to be a notch. Because if it's not notchy enough, it's not a notch. It's just a cut. So, yep. Little notch. And then, I'm going to show you how to assemble your blood arc gun. You're going to take your tube. And then, you're going to take the mouthpiece, which is this, the tip of the tip. There we go. Tip and put it in the end without the notch and just jam it in there all the way. Okay? That is not going to come out. So if you want to glue that in there, go ahead and glue that in there. Doesn't really matter what you do. So. Alright. And then with this in the side, well, before you do that, you want to take your blow dart. Your blow dart, right? And you want to put it into the tube with the fuzzy side going into the open end without the mouthpiece. Right? And then you just want to suck it in until you hear it hit the end of the mouthpiece. You're ready to fire right now, but you can always conceal it by putting the top of the, top of the pen over the mouthpiece and putting the back of the pen over the knot with the plate with the uh, at the end with the notch. The notch is so that you can pull the back oh gosh, didn't make the notch big enough. Back of the pen off. Okay? So that's why you have the notch in there. So make sure you can put this on and take it off with these. If you can do that, your pen gun is pretty much complete. Um, with some, you know, practice, you'll get pretty accurate with this, and, uh, so, but, um, another thing, you're going to want to keep changing your needles occasionally, because they'll get blunt, so change them frequently, not too frequently, but, like, if you, every 50 shots, about, doesn't have to be exact, but about every 50 shots. Let's just test out our blood blood art gun real quick. Obviously out on ourselves because we don't want to hurt ourselves. Alright, let's see. Just open this up. Just bite on the end of the pen. The barrel, the muzzle. There we go. Seems to work. This is a close range gun, by the way. You can go through the fabric of a hat though, so this actually uh, works pretty well on pretty much any fabric or wood I can get it stick to stick in the wall too and in the ceiling at school that works too so uh, yeah uh, have fun don't hurt yourself, really, don't um, be super careful with this thing as I said, it's really easy to hurt somebody with anything sharp. So have fun with your new pen gun, but don't hurt yourself because these things can be lethal. I'm not kidding. Don't hit anybody in the temple with these things. Seriously. No temple, anywhere else is fine. But, you know, just don't blame it on me. Uh, I think that's it. Wait, here.